A basket full of berries and a trap full of fish. All of it scattered and half eaten by beasts. Our two lost souls were here together. They must have been attacked, or they wouldn't have left their taking. Let's search the area. Maybe we can find their trail. seems to be home to some creatures. Let's be wary. It could very well be the lair of that great tenant the hunter spoke of. Judging from his clothing, he was a missionary. The two others are more recent. A man and a woman. No doubt our missing couple. They were dragged here and devoured alive. What a tragic fate. Fight! 
Move away. Things are about to get dicey. I cannot believe that these missionaries used such a ruse to achieve their goal. Two youths died because of them. Can we wonder why the natives have a bad opinion of us? Welcome! It's such a pleasure to see you again. Have you seen anything to your liking? What might I help you with?
Thank you for your visit. See you soon. Turn to the village. Their families need to be informed.
bit of poison on my blade. Then let's go! Move away! Things are about to get dicey! One more thing. Yes? I fought against a great number of Tenlands. One that was quite spectacular. A great white beast. Its mere presence seemed to aggravate the others, attract them and make them aggressive. A beast sent by the demons, no doubt. But... Stop taking me for a fool. We also found a journal outlining your vicious plan. I have only one piece of advice to give you. Leave, and quickly, or the Mother Cardinal will learn every detail of your manipulations. We shall be leaving as soon as possible. But let it be known that you are abandoning all of these poor souls to damnation. Perhaps you should be more concerned about your own soul, sister. People have died by your fault.
Well, on all Manawi, have you found my brother? I found him, but... I am truly sorry. Your brother is dead. And the May the Earth welcome him. I felt it. How did it come to pass? He knew every stone on our lands. It couldn't have been an accident. He had a liaison with a young girl from the village. They would meet in a clearing. They must have forgotten the hour. Night took them by surprise, and a tenlan crossed their path. I found both of them in the cavern of the beast. How terrible. Why did he go to see the girl in secrecy? They could have... I must recover his body. To give it up to the earth, as is our custom. Where is it? With the body of the girl he loved. In a cavern, near the clearing. But it is a dangerous place. Other Tenlands might still be roaming there. Though I did kill quite a few. I have a duty owed to my little brother. Thank you, Onol Manawi. I will not forget this. I must be leaving. any news? Do you know where my sister is? Yes. I'm truly very sorry. Oh no. Nah. Sir Tonsidag, please do not tell me that she is dead. I found her body in the lair of a great Tenlan. Not far from the clearing. But how could she have been surprised by the beasts? She knew the danger. She went out to meet the young fisherman. The time must have flown by into the night. I am so sorry. We found them both dead. I must bring her body back to carry out the right. You should not go alone. I killed as many as I could, but it would be better to be prudent. I shall follow your counsel on all Manawi. Two deaths are enough. Thank you. Thank you. I must leave now. The nests are destroyed. And with the death of the White Tenlan, the attacks should see. We were even able to convince the missionaries to leave. Kadazak should be willing to follow us now. Let us go and find him. face that you were victorious indeed i put the white tenlin down who was enraging his kind and destroyed their nests the attacks should no longer be troubling you as for the missionaries we were able to convince them to leave but they were not ready to admit their involvement in the attacks that harmed you and so they were in some way responsible i had my suspicions but i could not see their reasons they brought a particularly large beast here, that attracted and enraged the others. This is what provoked the attacks and brought on our despair. These people have blood on their hands. In the end, we found the missing young ones. Alas, too late. Devoured by wild beasts. And divorced tear end. You did well on our Manawi. Now they shall be able to find the rest. Will you accompany me now? My cousin needs your help. I have packed what is needed. I am ready to journey with you.
be the death of me. I can't control my body. It's like being a stranger in a marionette set ablaze, consumed by a smoldering fire. The moment's growing near, isn't it? Am I about to surrender my ghost to the Reaper of Souls? You flutter in just when you're needed, cousin. As always. Who are you? Your hand is cold as ice. Your cousin is burning. That is such a relief. Let me present Katasak Constantin. He is the greatest healer on the island. He will help you. Please, stay. I am here for you, Rnaikse. And I will not leave until I found a way to ease your pain and suffering. Fill your mind with the patience of the ocean. I know not how much time I will need. I've never seen such a sickness. The spirits of your lands must be quite horrendous to cast down such evils upon the peoples that live there. Thank you. Thank you, cousin. I don't want to imagine my plight without your intervention. My fair cousin! Come closer and tell me what brings you... Constantine, how are you feeling? Are you in great pain? This sickness is horrible, believe me. Now I understand what your mother went through. But you have not come to hear my complaints. Speak, it will give me something else to ponder. I'm going to leave now. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. <laughs>